I must admit, I'm not really sure what to think about this one, so I'm going to say it as it is and let you argue about it in the comments. One of you guys has kindly sent me an article that says whole city council are discussing a number of different initiatives, including turning one-way streets into a two-way route for cyclists. Now, let's think that through for a minute. It's ordinarily a one-way street, but cyclists are going to be allowed to go two ways up and down the same street. Not only does that sound confusing to me, but it sounds like the recipe for disaster. Now, I do see the argument where the council spokesperson has said allowing cyclists to ride two-way in a one-way street makes cycling in towns and cities more convenient by opening up the street network, providing shortcuts. But then it goes on to say it can also help to make cycling safer by offering alternatives to busy roads and may help stop people riding on the pavement. Now, I get that it might stop people riding on the pavement, but I'm not entirely convinced that it's going to make cycling safer by allowing cyclists to ride in both directions on a one-way street. What do you think in the comments? To me, that sounds contradictory. I'd like to see what my friend Ashley Neal thinks about this, whether, Ashley, whether you think that's a good idea or not. As I say, I'm not really sure what to think of it at the moment. I can see the pluses to it. I can see that it's going to have cyclists going in and out of these one-way streets through cities as opposed to the busy roads. But most serious cyclists, I think, are probably going to stick to the main roads anyway, rather than racing up and down the one-way streets. Just a thought to put it out there. And the obvious thing is, unless everyone knows what these rules are, People are going to get angry and confused. It's going to cause confusion, arguments, and frankly, I think it might be a bit dangerous and actually make it less safe rather than more safe. So I'm not really sure what to think of it, but anyway, like I said, drop me your comments down below. I'd love to read those. And if you want to use YouTube's new clip function, there's a button down below. You can take a snippet of my video and put it on a website somewhere for discussion. Obviously it uses my video. I'm not inviting you to download my video and use it without copyright authorization. But either way, I'd invite discussion on it. So let me know what you think and thanks for watching.